What's happening guys, it's Adam here and in today's video, I'm going to talk about how to cancel NordVPN and get a refund. So if you want to cancel NordVPN and get a refund quickly, don't waste your time following extra steps on other sites. Many of them will tell you to cancel your automatic recurring payments first, but this is simply not necessary. Okay, I signed up for the one month plan and went through the whole refund process to find the fastest way to get my money back. I'll show you the steps I took to get my refund within a week and how to deal with customer support so you can avoid any unnecessary trouble. But before I get into these steps, since you're watching this, you may also be looking for a replacement VPN. In this case, I'd recommend ExpressVPN because its features top what NordVPN offers and it delivers on speed. And then as a bonus, ExpressVPN has a no questions asked 30 day money back guarantee, which ensures you'll have zero hassle getting a refund. Okay, I'll share why I recommend ExpressVPN in a moment and then include a link for a coupon code in the description below. But for now, let's look at the steps you need to take to cancel your NordVPN account and get a refund. First, you need to log into your NordVPN account with your username and password. Next, click on the chat icon with the question mark on the bottom right of the NordVPN website. Then select either email or live chat to get in contact with a customer support representative. Of course, you can get a refund either way, but I found that the process is faster through live chat. Now at this point, you'll need to explain why you want to cancel, and then the Nord representative will likely try to troubleshoot your issues first as they want to try and retain you as a customer. So you need to explain your reasons for wanting to cancel. Once they understand that you no longer want to use the product and there's nothing they can do to help, they will give you your money back. Now, I asked for my refund through live chat, and the customer support agent was very friendly and genuinely wanted to know if there was any particular issue he could help me with. So after I explained that I didn't need the service anymore, he processed my refund immediately without further questioning. There was no hard selling after that. And now that your refund request has been processed, all you have to do is wait. The amount of time it takes to receive your refund depends on the payment method you use. Generally, this should take no longer than 10 business days. Full disclosure though, even with the steps I described earlier, it's not guaranteed that you will get a refund. There are some instances where NordVPN will not process a refund. For example, if you try and make a claim after 30 days, you won't be able to get your money back. Also, NordVPN won't be able to process your refund if you purchase your subscription on other marketplaces like Apple and Amazon you'll need to contact these platforms directly and the refund will be based on their terms and conditions. Okay, now that I've gone over how to cancel NordVPN and get a refund, let me give you a few reasons why I think you should consider using ExpressVPN instead. Now, NordVPN may have more servers than ExpressVPN, but ExpressVPN wins with speed. And in all my tests, ExpressVPN consistently delivers fast speeds that allow me to stream and torrent with very minimal buffering. In fact, most of the time, there's none at all. Also, ExpressVPN has military-grade security protocols that rival Nord's features. And so when I'm switching between servers, the automatic kill switch stops my internet traffic for a few seconds while it connects to a new server. Because of that, I know my data is never exposed. And it's great that ExpressVPN has never failed the DNS leak test, so you can always be assured that your information stays protected. ExpressVPN's trusted server technology also deletes all of your data from their servers every time you log out, so none of your data is stored. So if you ever need to get around online censorship or access unavailable content, you'll be glad to know that ExpressVPN is one of the few VPNs that reliably access sites. Even Netflix advanced VPN detection technology was no match for ExpressVPN. Another huge win for Express is that it's one of the few VPNs that work against China's firewalls which even NordVPN can't do. When it comes to refunds, ExpressVPN is way ahead with its no questions asked 30 day money back guarantee. All you have to do is request a refund using the 24 seven live chat without asking any questions. Okay, so that's how you cancel NordVPN and get a refund. But before I end this video, I'd like to take time to answer some frequently asked questions that I get about this topic. All right, so for the first question, how many days do I have to request a refund from NordVPN? So you have a 30 day period from your subscription date to get a refund from Nord. This is shown in its 30 day money back guarantee and their policy. And for the next question, can I get a refund if I purchase Nord through a prepaid card or a gift card? Well, no, payments made with a prepaid card or a gift card can't be refunded. And for the last question, can I get a refund if I purchase from Amazon, Best Buy, Stack Social, or another reseller? Well, no, unfortunately, NordVPN can't refund purchases from any reseller. You'll have to request a refund from where you made the purchase, and they will process your refund based on their policies. So hopefully this video was helpful. If so, please feel free to give a thumbs up as that always makes my day. And just a reminder, if you're interested in trying out ExpressVPN, be sure to check out the special discount links I'll put in the description area below so that you can save some money. Also, if you have any questions, please leave a comment. And if you're a new subscriber, welcome to our cyber family. Be sure to stay safe and I'll look for you in the next video.